Hey what's up YouTube this is Imash from Tech Portal and in this video I'm going to show you how to install original stock rom in your Samsung Galaxy J7 and in this video we will use smart switch to install original rom in our Samsung Galaxy J7 so without any further ado let's get started <laughs> So now open Google in your PC or laptop and type smart switch and it will redirect you to this. So click on this first link and here we have the smart switch website. Just click on this download for Windows and if you have Mac OS you can download it. I have Windows so I am clicking on it. As I have already downloaded this here you can see it is around 36 MB and just install it and don't connect your phone via USB while installing it will not install and after installing restart your computer and just open it and here you can see that it is asking to connect your phone so I am going to connect my device now so here it is connecting my device I am using F model Make sure that you have an active internet connection. Oh, my device is locked. So here I have unlocked my device. So here you can see that uh, it is showing that 936 MB of update is available. Later. But before clicking on update button, I want to show you that you can set backup items also like you can create backup and restore it later in case you, you have lost any data and here we have backup items like select all in person contents we can uh, connect contacts as planner messages and we have also multimedia settings options also and we can also backup our SD card so I prefer you to first create a backup by clicking here and click on backup and it will save a backup of your internal and external SD card it will it can take around 5 to 10 minutes or depending on your data so first create backup and it will help you to restore it later after the new update it will take time so I am skipping that part so here the backup has been completed and you can see that it is around 13.7 GB here we have all the files which we have selected now I can restore easily my um, apps settings music videos messages contacts without installing or copying them and it will take a lot of time so use smart switch to restore so now we will update our J7 so now just open this so now connect your phone via USB cable to PC and open smart switch and here you can see that a new software version is available so now just click on update and just click on this and here you can see that before updating a rooted device may cause update as I have a rooted device and it is recommended to use an official Samsung USB cable and fully charge the battery make sure that you have fully charged backup so now we will click on and don't use your phone while updating and it may break your phone and don't use any other so now just click on ok So now it is downloading files for J7 and it can take very longer time depending on your internet speed. 
so don't worry it will take time so I am skipping that part so here my phone is automatically boot into download mode so just let's wait for the installing to be completed so here it is 100 so software is complete the device will now restart so now you can disconnect and reconnect the cable So here it is optimizing app so we can wait for its optimizing to be complete. So I am skipping that part. So here the optimizing has been completed. Here you can see that all the system apps has been installed. Here you can see all the apps. We have smart manager everything. So let's check the security patch. So here, here you can see that we have 2016-5. This is May patch. And the best part of using this method is I have not lost any of the data. You can see that my all the apps has been already installed in this. I have my call logs as it is. I have my settings, messages, my apps, my music everything is the same so that's all with this and now I have s bike mode also in the previous update I don't have that because I'm using December update and now we have with the May update so that's all with this video and if you have any queries you can just comment in the comment box and if you like this video don't forget to hit the subscribe button it will help me to grow so I will see you in the next video thank you Ichigo.